So real quick, I don't really have that much time right now, so we're gonna go fast. Long story short, I changed phones to my mom's old phone, and it's pretty old, and they don't sell new cases for it, so the only case that she had that I could use was this red case. I wanted to spice things up a little, you know, turn it into a watermelon, because why the heck not? And if you happen to have a red case and you want to do the same thing, then cool! Anyways, thank you so much for checking this out. And yeah, without further ado, let's get into it. Alright, so here's a real quick before picture of what the phone case looks like. It's basically just a red case that is a little transparent. The first step is basically just to take off the case from the phone, just separate the two. And I'm going to cut three pieces of paper, one white, one dark green, and the other light green. And this is going to look like the rind of the watermelon. Alright, so once I have that, I'm going to take some packaging tape and just lay it over the top. Make sure you have enough to fold over the sides. I actually ran out, but that's okay because I'll get more later. And just try to keep all the air bubbles out by um, rubbing it. I don't really know how else you would do it. And just fold it over like this. Hopefully this stays. I don't know. This might fall apart in like a month or so. We'll see. And then I'm going to trace a piece of white paper, and the reason I'm doing this is because the case is kind of transparent and the phone itself is black, so when I put the red on the black, it kind of looks like a muddy red, so I'm going for a more vibrant. So I'm going to smash a white piece of paper between the case and the phone so that the vibrant red kind of stands out and just looks more watermelony. <laughs> Okay, and I'm going to stick that on, and then now I'm going to take a sharpie and draw the seeds, which is just little ovals and then now I'm just measuring the pieces of paper so that they lie flat on the top I don't want them to fold over the sides but if you do that's cool you can experiment with that let me know how that goes okay I'm gonna line them up the way I want it to take another piece of packaging tape and just lay it over again just try to keep all the air bubbles out and yeah, I'd be really surprised if this took you more than 20 minutes. I almost didn't even film this, but I was like, you know what? I want to at like the last minute because I'm actually working on something else, another video. So stay tuned for that. It should be interesting because it's a lot of work. And yeah, here it is. Thank you so much for checking this out. I hope you found this fun. See you next time.